Welcome, one and all, to my next LP. Let's get right into it. A game without an intro, and one of my favorite nostalgic games of all time. Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. The first Mario RPG I ever played. Now, this will not be a 100% LP, even though I have beaten this game countless times. But I will just, I will only be showing off everything to the best of my abilities. So I will not be showing off every single thing, obviously. First things first, since I haven't checked, just checking options, got nothing to wrote. Mario Bros. is just a little minigame thing. That may be a bonus episode one day. But the main thing we want to do is start up Mario and Luigi. And let's start up a new game. Yes, if you didn't catch my post, this LP, my second LP, was originally supposed to be Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. But due to technical difficulties with the... <coughs> excuse me, due to technical difficulties with the Dolphin, I can't do any GameCube games. Way too much of a slowdown. But anyway, what do we got here? Nothing good, of course. Holy cow. So we got a wizard attacking Peach right off the bat. I wonder who that is. Could it be one of the most beloved Mario characters of all time? We'll find out. Yeah, this game I love how it just gets right into it. Well, we clearly established the villain of the game right away. Another great thing I love about this game, it has a lot of humor. And you'll see what I mean probably right away. Like that. <laughs> Plenty more to come. Well, for this brief moment we can control Toad. All you need to do is head up the stairs, head down here. Apparently Mario's taking a shower. Hmm. I never get tired of that scene. And that was me fake laughing, not really the microphone. Something's wrong with Peach, of course. Now this! <laughs> I've always loved that. This game's music always used to scare me as a kid, though. We got Bowser already, holy crap. Oh jeez. Uh-oh. Oh boy. Oh, great. Super coward bros. Well, apparently we're fighting Bowser right off the bat. Yes, we got a little tutorial battle. I will be explaining things instead of the tutorial happening. So for your turn, all we can do now is our solo jump attack. So you just jump on Bowser, and the moment you land on top of him, press the A button. And then dodge by jumping with Z. Or A and Z in my case, A and possibly your case. Nope, I'm explaining everything here. Action commands are just pressing the right button when the attack lands to do extra damage. Like, if I didn't press... You know, he has 9 health, so I can show it off. If I don't press anything, they'll only do 1 damage. But here, you can jump over that. That if I press it right when I hit him, it does extra. Now he's gonna remind me about dodging, I think. I just showed you. You just jump. Yeah, this game has a lot of talking. Oh, wow. First fail, but this battle is unlosable. It's impossible to lose this battle, actually is. And that's a get rid of him. He only has 9 health. Yep, just a little tutorial against Bowser. Of all people. Okay, so the Goodwill Ambassador from the Bean Bean Kingdom stole Peach's voice. Holy crap! Peach, watch your language! Yeah, tell me about it. Holy cow! Wouldn't that be awesome if you just talked and you could make bombs or something? <sighs> um, yeah, of course, because we're always Mario. So, this is one of the few people Mar This is one of the few Mario games that does not take place in Mushroom Kingdom, of all things. 
compared to like this, a galaxy and stuff like that. The Koopa Cruiser to Bean Bean Kingdom. HOLY COW! <laughs> I love that so much. Yep. Alright, so you can talk to everyone here to learn about some stuff. Like, this guy tells you about the action icons, like, you could talk to someone there. Um, let's see, talk to this person. You could do a super jump only once in the game. I hate that. But anyway, there's some, also some items and everything you can collect around here. So what we want to do first is head up here. If you come all the way down here, there's an exclamation point, so if you check that, you can find something precious. And if you talk to this guy, you you get a wanna mushroom, which is like a phoenix down if you're playing a Final Fantasy game. I can never do this on my first try. If you want to jump right at the end, come over here and get a mushroom. Alright, and if we head over here, you'll definitely want to talk to this guy. Got some briefing the Bowser baddies. Yes, I do know where Bowser has gone. Bowser went that way. Yeah, you want to tell him the right way. If you don't, you'll get a little amusing scene. But if you do tell him the right way to go, you'll get a little reward not so later on in the game. And if you come up here, jump and get this mushroom for the toad. Of course. And he, he let us keep that and gave us a super mushroom. Think of them as potions and super potions from Pokemon. So we jump up here, got Luigi. Italian all the way. Yeah, I love that. But, let's head on. This is a very puzzly type RPG. Here we got our save. I'll be super speed and saving. That's another thing. I will not... Battles in this game are going to be difficult to super speed. So I'll be cutting out a lot of stuff probably instead. Since I can't really... Super speeding through action commands would be extremely dangerous. But anyway, we got Toadsworth here. And he'll give us a suitcase, which is basically our menu item of the game. So that'll come in very handy. The only problem is you press SELECT to use it, not START, which really bothers me. And we got 100 coins. Oh, Luigi's not coming with us? But well, this game is called Mario and Luigi. Huh. Well, let's check out that suitcase. Well, that me. Alright. Guess we can do that later. So here's the guy we helped earlier. Let's head up here. That's Bowser, alright. And he's flailing. Of course. I haven't played this game in so long, it's such a good game. Bowser Baddies! Bye bye! Bye bye! Oh, I'm probably gonna be copying Mario and Luigi's voices a lot. <laughs> I don't think Luigi wants to go. Yeah, you. <laughs> Mr. Green. I mean, no one even calls him Luigi in this game. Oh my gosh. Your gnarliness. Alright, the baddies. Holy cow. <laughs> Luigi. All we got are five Koopas, two red Koopas, five Koopas, five red Koopas, and five Goombas. And Luigi just tried to sneak out of there. A deserter? I wonder who that is. That cruiser looks really small, but I wonder who the deserter could be. Yeah. Holy cow, we can run fast. But not that fast. Yeah, you're coming with us whether you like it or not, Luigi. Skies above Mushroom Kingdom. And what's your name? Green guy. They have no respect for Luigi at all. Got an intercom apparently. I'll try from the Bean Bean Kingdom. Okay. There we go. Okay, now we can open the suitcase. I also tried to for ugh. I also just remembered something. I probably shouldn't save that often. But anyway, here we got items. We've got these, 25 health, 50 health, and heal. I mean revive. Equipment. We'll get more into that later on. 
and we've got the bros info. So as you can see, this is an RPG game, obviously. Luigi is going to take a little longer to level up than Mario, but Luigi is more defensive while Mario is more offensive. That's how it generally is, but there's going to be a lot of differences later on in this game that we'll be able to handle. You can talk to everyone for just some other instructions, but we're fine. Also, now that we have both of them, we can now control both rows with A and B, so A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. Yeah, that's a bros block. You just jump using the right bro, and you'll get coins. And now I should also mention, well, it'll tell you in a second. It'll actually tell me in a second, so let's head out of here. Apparently I'm taking pictures. What are you doing? We need passports. Just like going out of the country. Alright, so they found- this is where you'd open up your suitcase. Well, these are- so those are passports, I see. But they're blank. Yeah, no photos. Yeah. Lucky! Yep, we can take our photos. Now, the thing about taking photos, I'm gonna say quickly... Oh, sorry. Is that... this. Don't go pressing any buttons. So, you could just take a normal picture, but I think it'd be better if we made a different pose. I'll do that one. And now it'll tell us if you press start, you just change the order of them. Which changes in later games, which really bothers me. And there we go, we got two scared faces. So let's take a look at that. Yeah. <laughs> Little gimmick you can do. Now, you can change these later on if you're not happy with what happened. But, I'm fine with it. But, you'll always be able to change it later, so don't worry. I like usually just having Mario on first, just because I like jumping with... And also, when you press start, the buttons change. So you'll press A for Luigi, it's different. But if you talk to this guy, this is the guy we helped out earlier. And for helping him out, we get a free 1-Up Mushroom, which is very nice. Get here and get another Mushroom. Yeah, definitely make sure to get every free item you can in this game. Very much worth it. Alright, so we've got a barrel. Oh, Donkey Kong. What do we do? Ooh. That barrel had nothing in it, and Mario just talked to him about a potato. Okay, we gotta go meet Bowser. Um, no thank you. But can I still... I don't need a tutorial to know how to fight. I think he's still gonna give it to us. Yes, he is. Okay, this is the tutorial that's forced, then. And I want to show this because you do get EXP. So, basically to dodge, you just do the same thing I was explaining earlier, but Luigi's always gonna use B for all his actions, while Mario uses A. And right there, you can dodge that. And do that. And if you, as you see, some enemies, you can counter-attack them, depending on their patterns, and when you jump. Yep, just saying that. Use everything B. Alright, so... That Goomba's at... Ugh. These Goombas have four health, so that one's at one, so it can finish from a counter-attack. So let's work on getting get rid of... Getting rid of that Goomba, my gosh. Yep, see, it just goes down from counter-attack, and get that one out of the way. And we got 4 EXP for both of them. Alright, so let's move on. We got another one here. Oh! I, another tutorial? Nope. Yeah, these battles I probably won't be super speeding, but later on in the game, when there's a lot of battles and not enough time, I will probably just be cutting them out, as they will make the video go on way too long. Or early on right now, they're necessary, and obviously I'll show off new enemies. Well, here's a little, the interesting thing about the game. You can give bonuses to your stats, which is really nice. Now, some stats won't really be that good at this point, as you can see. You can see the range of how much they'll increase by. The more you increase the stats, the less the value will be at the bonus. 
and vice versa. So let's say I only upgrade BP for, for three levels. If I go to practically anything else, it is guaranteed almost to get a really high boost. But to customize is any way you wish. Usually, you're gonna want to prioritize HP, BP, power, and speed. Defense and stat- Defense you don't have to worry about if you're good at this game, which I've played a lot. And stash is just for crits, so it's not that big of a deal. So I'm gonna go for power on Mario. Actually, no, because- yeah, Let's go for HP. Yes. Eh, uh, still got one. But, it's something. Yeah, you'll get one a lot, but... I'm not going for a perfect playthrough or anything like that. Where I need all my stats to be amazing. This guy, a Koopa can't catch a Goomba. Where, what has the world come to? Seriously. Mario and Mr. Greeny. Now here's another little interesting thing. You can get preemptive attacks on the enemy. If you jump on them. Oh my gosh. Jump on them before battle, and they'll take damage. Which is very nice. Now one thing I'll tell us here, if you fail and the enemy will hit the other per the other guy in the back, that one will be down. It'll happen eventually, so I shouldn't have to explain it. Just trust me, it will happen. I tend to screw up all the time in this. And now we get Luigi a level up. As you can see, Luigi is very more bulky, but his speed is terrible. But right now, there's not really any good upgrade for it, so I'm gonna go for power. Eh, it's something. The stats do make a huge difference in this game, though. Trust me. Alright, let's capture that Goomba. And just do the same thing to the other one. Not that hard at all. Like, through the same dialogue. Like, probably through those points I'll be super speeding. This is just the same thing. Alright, now let's head on up. Let's not save, we don't need to right now. And what we need to do... Let's talk to this guy. And that block activates the pinch crane. Well, it's an exclamation block, which always usually means something good, so let's do it. It looks like scissors. Um, that's not cargo! Yeah! Oh, how rude they are. Well, they are Bowser baddies, I guess. I mean, look at that! Look at that! Uh, they're gonna call Bowser so many different things. Finally passing over the border. Holy cow! It's all the hoopla. Whoa! <laughs> Way to add insult to injury. What is it? It's you! Cackletta! That is our villain of this game. Cackletta the wizard. Oh boy. Fawful is her minion. Well, probably one of the most beloved characters in Mario history. As you can see, just how he talks even makes it perfect. The mustard of your doom. And his headgear just one-shot Bowser, apparently. How'd he get behind us? Next, it is the turn of you. We have our next, basically, tutorial battle again with Fawful. I believe he has around 18 to 20 health. For the battle, just keep the same as... Just do the same things that you normally would. Now, see, when he said that... Fink Rat, one of his catchphrases, it was in red, so you wanted to jump over... Ugh. Wow, I'm really disoriented today. If he speaks in red, he's gonna attack Mario, and obviously Green Luigi. Let's do that. And Bowser's basically just gonna explain to us what I just told you. See there? Just Mario. So let's do another 4 damage to him. Have you readiness for this? Now, this attack is different. When he uses have you readiness for this, since it's green, he'll go for Luigi, but he'll also attack the other one. Yep, a little different. Just showing you different enemies' commands. And I lied. Yeah, I think he has like 30 health. 
30 some health. Let's just keep attacking. Did we get him? Nope, we just got the headgear. Now we have Fawful to deal with. Now is when I ram you. Now that one's a little bit easier to dodge, obviously. Let's just do that. He should be gone after this attack, hopefully. Okay, he has a lot more health than I thought. Okay, he does have a ton of health. Finally. I mean, look at him! How could Fink rats like you be such an awful nasty as me? How can you not love Fawful? I have Fury. His most famous line. Oh boy. Holy cow! Here's my question, why didn't he just do that to us in the beginning? But... I guess it's enough to destroy the Koopa Cruiser. Who are these guys? If there are guys at all. We have binoculars, apparently. General Starshade. Meteorites confirmed. Holy cow, we're falling. Ow! Impact in Stardust Fields. The Bean Bean Borderland. Oh man, even all the Koopas got knocked out from that. <laughs> Way to go, Mario. How to land? Crush your brother. Way to go. Apparently Mario loves talking about tomatoes. I mean, potatoes. Alright. Well, we got the Koopas here. Psh, oh well. Well, they're in trouble. On the other side of the border, so this is the border, apparently. But, I think that's enough for the first part. So, next time on Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga, we will be crossing over to the Bean Bean Kingdom. This is Mr. Ilu, and I'll see you next time.